Hello everybody, this is Chris from HackerDaily.com. Today's little episode, I'm going to show you how to monitor websites. And this is great if you're trying to find a deal on certain sites. And it can be used for other things too, to see if a site's opened or changed its web page for whatever reason. And I'm going to show you how to do this with a free application for Windows called WebMon. So let's switch over to our browser. Now WebMon um, is very easy to use. I'm going to bring open WebMon real quick. Right now I have it monitoring a hottopic.com web page for rock band promotion for the Xbox 360. I'm going to um, open the, the page so you see what I'm looking at. Right now Hot Topic is having a sale on rock band for um, 85, basically $85 and this is usually a $170 item. Now these things are coming and going in and out of stock and you got to be quick to catch them because it's a real hot item especially the time of year I'm filming this is near Christmas and um, a lot of people are trying to buy this. Now I don't have time to sit all day and monitor this website for changes so what I'm doing here is using WebMon to monitor this web page and in particular you can tell WebMon just to look at one section of the page see where it says where this item is completely sold out that's what I want to monitor when this goes away um, this item's in stock again and I'm able to jump on and buy it at the discounted rate and I don't have to sit around and wait for it to happen because I have WebMon monitoring the page I'm going to go into properties um, of what's happening here basically you tell it the website you want to monitor and you can tell it to look at a specific amount of content now I'm looking for the keyword sold out okay so it found it for me so I want it to start monitoring right before the sold out term so you can tell it to use selected text as the starting point and right after the sold out term which is the reason it's already green and red because I've already selected these and you select a text as the um, ending point and what it's going to do is every so often you can set the time here it's going to check in between these two sets of text on this website and if this happens to change at all meaning that the word sold out is now gone it will uh, monitor or alert you um, you can have it do a number of things you can have it run a program you can have it just play an alert I think it even send you an email if you want and um, it's a really neat little piece of software and it's great for um, just checking on websites for changes say that something's closed you have a private site that's normally closed and once in a while they open for um, new members this is an excellent piece of software to um, do or um, some sites like repidshare.com might have free download day and this is a good way to monitor record share so you know when that's about to happen. Again, it's called WebMon. I'm going to have a link on it at HackerDaily.com with the show notes. So visit our website for the link and some more information on this great little free program. Again, I'm Chris from HackerDaily.com, and see you next time.